Drivers to this project and will continue to bring their talents to the next phase are in the room and have a reason to be proud today. I'd like to take a moment to enter NCIC and the Uniform Crime Reporting Program. In the 18 years that followed, CJIS has been a model of change and growth for the FBI and for the community. In 1993, the number of fingerprints processed was 8.1 million that year. In 2011, the staff here handled more than six times that number. That's, that's what worked for her, for him, for a long time, now happily for me, knows this whole history. And to learn that history and learn what he put into it and what has come out of it, and it was, it was, it was, uh, it was even new to the people of West Virginia, even when it was, when it was un, in place and operating. We knew it was terrific because there were a lot of people employed there. But what were they really doing? Well, they're going to know about it someday. People are going to know about it. So I say bravo to you. Uh, I've had the, intelli the privilege of serving on the Intelligence Committee and sharing it uh, during times where information sharing, in other words, DOD and FBI working together. I mean, that sounds pretty easy, but remember after 9-11, the first bill we had to pass in Congress was to allow the CIA and the FBI to actually talk to each other. So stovepipes are not easily overcome, but they've been overcome for this project, and thank God for that. So um, I wish you the best. I wish you complete and personal fulfillment, a sense of pride that you must feel in doing the work that you do and knowing what the results of that work will be and how it will have a worldwide effect. I mean, biometrics will be defined, defined by what goes on here. Already is. So God bless every one of you. And thank you. Almost 51 million fingerprints of each other's help as we move forward. We've appreciated the partnership with the FBI. I look forward to the enduring nature of that partnership as represented by this facility, but also by the people who are here today who are committed to making this a success. With that, thank you very much. So on behalf of all the officers, sheriffs, deputies, agents, and investigators, for all the soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines, on behalf of the American public, and me, thank you for all that you do and keep up the We truly are open for business. I think you know that. And it's we, we've got a state that's got great people. I brag all the time. We're the most patriotic state in the nation. Fought more for wars and, and battles, shed more blood for the cause of freedom than most any state. We dig the coal uh, and mine that coal that builds the steel, makes the steel that builds the ships and defends the country. Our little state does it all. And we're proud of that. And you even take us over the top. You're like the icing on the cake right now for what you do.